Hello guys, welcome back to the Albanian Madridista channel and um, I hope you guys saw the introduction video earlier today. If you didn't, um, please check it out. And um, yeah, let's talk about the games from this weekend. Um, man, we won 6-0, let's go, I'm really happy. Um, yeah, Kareem Benzema with the hat trick. Rodrigo scored, Asensio scored, and Vasquez managed to score as well. Uh, really happy for the team. We all played well. Um, we played brilliant. I thought we were exceptional. Um, this had to be our most dominant game. Uh, dominant performance, I should say, uh, for this season. And, yeah, when we're at home, we, we play so good. It's always, you know, magical and impressive. And this is what the Bernabeu is all about. And this is what Real Madrid is all about. After all, um, yeah, big 6 0 against Valvadoid. Uh, oh, I mean, Valadolid, however you say it. And, um, yeah, 6 0 win at home, kept a clean sheet. Uh, yeah, really important victory as we, you know, we're trying to keep up to um, Barca in the league title. Um, at the moment, we are 12 points behind. And, um, yeah, I know for a fact we can catch up. So uh, yeah, and um, yeah, we've been we we played so well, and um, yeah, really good, really good um, football we played. Yep. Hopefully we can continue like this and try to be more consistent. And we will play on Wednesday in the Copa del Rey against Barcelona. So, yeah, um, really big game. And, um, yeah, El Clasico, here we go. And, um, yeah, and speaking of uh, also another big game, their classicer, Bayern won 4 2. Um, I expected Bayern to win anyway. Um, they did play really good football. Um,. Yeah, they, they, they played really good. One of the best uh, football games I've seen in the Bundesliga. And, I um, mean, yeah, they played so well. They played well together. They have insane chemistry, Bayern Munich. Yeah, they, they, they have um, one of the best uh, football uh, coaches in the world, Tuchel, which um, they get sacked by Chelsea months ago. Yeah, managed to... Um, Guys, first win, and especially in their classic group too. Um, yeah, that puts Bayern two points ahead of Dortmund. Uh, so the title race is still on for the Bundesliga. And um, yeah, let's see. Let's see if Dortmund can try to catch up. And man, Man City versus Liverpool. Oh man, Liverpool absolutely destroyed. Well, got destroyed, I should say. Sorry. Uh, got destroyed by Liverpool at the Etihad. 4-1. 4-1. Oh, man, yeah, this is um, not not a good game. Not a good sight for uh, Liverpool. Klopp, the players, and their fans. Um, losing 4-1 at Anfield, man. Liverpool have just not been good away this season. I think they're 13th in the away table. I think, yeah. No, nah, but... City, uh, they managed to win without Holland, so yeah, that's really good. They they managed to play really good, good counterattacking football. Um, Jurgen Klopp really, really like might need the sack at this point if Liverpool continue to play like this away specifically, and they do play away tomorrow against Chelsea at Stamford Bridge. So um. Yeah, it's four one win for Man City. Um, still eight points behind Arsenal. Um, I think Arsenal will win the league at the end of the season. And um, yeah, I hope to see Arsenal win the league. I hope we can try to win the league as well. And uh, yeah, and pff, I just hear I just heard Graham Potter getting sacked from Chelsea. Oh man, that that I think was a good choice because. Chelsea on a par have been terrible. They have been terrible. They are eleventh in the league, twelve points away from champion uh, from the Champions League spots. Uh, now they have Bruno Saltor as their uh, interim boss. So yeah, 
I think Nagelsmann should be the the manager for um, Chelsea next season. So um, yeah, Chelsea are in a crisis, and let's see how they they perform for the rest of the season. So yeah, that's about it, guys. Um, thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe, give it a like, um, turn on the notifications so you wouldn't want to miss a thing. Thank you for watching this video, and have a good day.